Access Bank today made history in the Nigerian debt capital market as it listed the Pioneer Climate Bond Certified Green Bond at the FMDQ OTC Exchange in Lagos. Given the welcome address, the Associate Executive Director Capital Markets FMDQ, Ms. Tumi Shekoni, speaks on the benefits of green bonds to develop markets in Africa. FMDQ is in partnership with Climate Bonds Initiative and FSD Africa to help develop the green bond market in Nigeria. And this journey for us started uh, a few years ago, a couple of years, well, yeah, about two years ago, where in December 2017, there was a meeting between the group managing director of Access Bank's PLC, the managing director of FMDQ and um, CBI Africa. That's um, Justine, I think. I think probably everyone knows her. And in that meeting, the, the, it was sort of um, FMDQ understood or knew about the journey, the sustainability journey of Access Bank. And one of the things we're trying to do was develop, or we are trying to do is develop the non-sovereign green bond markets in Nigeria. And we're looking for a pipeline of potential issuers. And we, you know, understanding or knowing about um, Access Bank's sustainability journey, we thought we should approach them. And that culminated in the meeting with um, the group managing director, our MD and CBI um, Africa. That's in December 2017. So this led to some sort of partnership between FMDQ and Access Bank PLC, and they have been very supportive in all that we've been trying to do in um, developing the green bond markets in Nigeria. Again, what FMDQ tries to do is develop the market for the market. There's so much potential in Nigeria, and you obviously need some champions to be able to, to, to sort of take that forward. And we know that working together, we'll be able to achieve all sorts of things. The special address by Mr. Herbert Wigwe Group Managing Director, Access Bank PLC, gave insight into the significance of the listing to the Nigerian market. Just as has been said already, it's important for you to start initiatives that ensure that we live our lives responsibly. And the only way to do it is to make sure that you don't just have it as a one-way track, one or two institutions. No, let us look for institutions that have a strong convening power to bring many, many more people all right, to do things, act responsibly, and in ways that can protect our environment and, of course, our continent. So coming here today to list the first climate-certified green bond in the continent for us is a thing of pride. And we think that hopefully it will open up the markets for several other green initiatives, hopefully, because that is the whole idea. Just as Tumi said, it's extremely important. We need to basically see how we can get more and more institutions in our country, more and more banks, all right, to come in and join us in this whole crusade. The instrument is 15 billion naira. It will be used for, obviously, for the uh, purpose specified, things that are uh, friendly as from a climate standpoint, um, solar powered systems, uh, things that basically help protect the environment and all. And we're all aware of all the big changes and the climate changes happening world over. We can see it happening in places like Mozambique, etc., etc. And if we don't take and live responsibly, all right, all of that is going to come to happen to us um, across the entire continent. So for me, it's a big day. Um, I just want to say that FMDQ is or was is a, a, a institution of choice for several reasons. First, uh, it is a leading exchange in the in the country. Um, secondly, it is known for things that have to do with innovation, things that have to do with uh, digital, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And so we're extremely happy to be listed on the exchange today. And of course, we know that we're in very capable hands. And so today promises to be a very, very important day in the life of our institution. Again, this for many other reasons. And we thank you uh, for, for allowing us to do it on your exchange. Thank you. Highlight of the event was the formal signing of the document to finalize the listing activity at the FMDQ OTC exchange. DMD Access Bank PLC, Mr. Roosevelt Ogbona, speaks on the essence of the Green Bond Initiative to sustainability. I think uh, for the size of the instrument we're doing, renewable energy is one we're going to focus on in the course of the next two to three years. And a lot of the investment that we're going to be making will be towards supporting clean energy, uh, renewables, that will also support businesses to grow. So that's where our focus will be over the next uh, couple of years. Managing Director, Chapel Hill Denham Advisory Limited, Mrs. Olukemi Awodeyin 
shared the focus of the Green Bonds Initiative in Nigeria. Um, so the focus um, of the Green Bond first, I mean the greening is the focus um, to promote sustainability. So even with what you've mentioned regarding electricity, it has to be sustainable. Is it solar? Is it um, wind? It has to be um, sustainable. What we're here today to do is to list the Green Bond, cert first certified Green Bond issued by Access Bank um, in Africa, in Nigeria, um, and on the back of uh, the federal government's issuance of its own green bond, this is encouraging because it'll also encourage other corporates, you know, to come to the market to fund um, sustainable projects that have environmental benefits. With the listing of the 15 billion naira pioneer green bond at a coupon rate of 15.50% and a tenure that will elapse by 2024, Access Bank has set the pace for climate finance activities in Nigeria that will form the basis for developing a sustainable economy.